Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another edition of Phil's Five. I hope your week is going well. Doing this a little bit early today because I'm actually getting ready to head out to Birmingham, Alabama to meet with some of my peers who are the executive officers of other larger local associations here in the country. So I'm really looking forward to reconnecting with them and kind of sharing some stories about how we're managing our, our collective issues here. But it uh, will be good to meet with them here starting later today. But first, I wanted to kick off with, uh, unfortunately, some sad news. We recently learned of the passing of architect uh, Mark Humphreys. And uh, Mark uh, was the founder of Humphreys and Partners Architects, and he was the largest designer of multifamily projects in the country, a member of our association since 1998. And uh, he passed away, unfortunately, on January 6th after a lengthy illness. And just seeing from the Facebook posts that we put up, all the stories and uh, tributes coming into him are just reflective and commensurate of just a, an incredible legacy that he left and an indelible mark on how we build here in the Dallas area. When uh, we get service information, we'll be sure to pass that on to y'all, but our thoughts are, are with uh, the Humphreys family and all that uh, he impacted. Uh, the next thing that we've got on the list here is our uh, McSam Awards. The official call for entries has been made as of this morning. You can go to McSamAwards.com and check that out. There's a video on there that shows you how to submit entries and basically how to kind of make the most of your submissions and set you up in a good place to uh, get a favorable review by the judges. So those uh, those are up there. Be sure to, again, go to McSamAwards.com. Uh, third, speaking of videos, we are we're making a lot of progress on our office, and I'm really excited about that. We've got painters in there. They're going to be finished up sometime early next week, and then our hope is to get basically a small army of finished trades in there and make uh, quite a bit of progress after after the painters move on. There's a series of videos that a lot of them very recent that are up, and I'll share this on uh, some of the, the feeds that I share this uh, video on, but it's uh, a lot of things that Mark or that Michael Turner is doing to our uh, building and has a lot of like tips and tricks that he's showing off as you make the progress and there'll be more of those coming. So uh, be sure to check that out and follow our progress. And, you know, one time here soon, you're going to see me do one of these videos back in the somewhat familiar place of, of my office. And I can't wait for that to happen. We're, uh, we're getting there. Absolutely. Uh, education, they are putting out as we get into the first uh part of the year here, they're putting out a call for individuals that are interested in becoming instructors. You'll find an application for that in today's punch list, or you can contact Sheena Beaver in our office. And then finally, look in your mailbox. The membership rosters are on their way, making their way through the system, and they should be delivered anytime now uh, this month. So be sure to check that out. There's an online version that's up already at dallasbuilders.org. You can go to membership and then the find members tab it's not just a listing or a phone book or anything like that. It's a great membership resource. It's got a lot of information there about uh, the organization. And, you know, be sure to put, take 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 a look at that because uh, Barcy Vilches and uh, Holly Pemberton in our office did an incredible job of putting that together, uh, the artwork, the layout, and everything else. So, again, go to DallasBuilders.org, check that out. Thank you for checking out my video this week, and I hope you have a good one. We'll talk to you soon. Take care. Bye.